Welcome to Corporal's Corner. Today we're going to make an urban survival toilet. So stick around. About a year ago we shot a video on the Woodsman's Throne. which is basically a glorified long-term latrine. And in that video, we talked about hygiene being a morale booster, meaning that if you feel good physically, you feel good psychologically. So I wanna go ahead and take that same methodology and apply it to an urban setting. And here's why. Most of us live in a city or small town. Imagine a long-term man-made or natural disaster. The grid's down, power's out, water's off. At some point, you're gonna to wanna to relieve yourself. And you need to do it in a sanitary fashion. So let's go ahead and kick this off with an urban survival toilet. Now grabbing an ordinary five gallon bucket, could be from Home Depot, Lowe's, an old paint bucket, it doesn't matter. As long as you have a functional handle, there's no cracks, and you have a bottom, you're good to go. Next, grab a trash bag liner. Now the thicker the mills of the plastic, the better, and if you're concerned, you can always double bag it. All we're gonna do here, I'm gonna tighten it up. I'm going to twist it and then tighten an overhand knot. So far, so good. Let's go ahead and talk about our seat. It could be something as simple as a 2x4 cut in half. Lean back, and get her done. It's nice and stable, and I think in a pinch or a bind, this would be good to go. But I'm not entirely comfortable, and I think we can do better. And now for option number two, which is my personal favorite. We're going to give it that added touch of comfort. And to do that, I have my regular and deluxe swim noodle. You see one's larger than the other. There's also a diameter difference. Selecting your comfort level, all we're going to do, we're going to measure out about three feet. We're going to cut it. And then starting at one end, we're going to slice a straight line all the way to my opposite end, spread it apart, and spread it around the rim of that bucket, making it an improvised cushioned toilet seat. And for one final touch, go ahead and remove your handle. Grab the toilet paper of your choice. Slide it on there. Replace your handle. You're good to go. Smoothing it once again. That's what I'm talking about. And by the looks of it, I have that natural V shape. Everything will work out nicely. Welcome back. Not only was that outstanding, it was also refreshing. Now, like I mentioned in my questions and answers video, from time to time, I'm gonna go ahead and toss in one or two of these urban survival videos. And why is that? Well, it's my opinion that before you can bushcraft happily ever after out in the woods, you need to be able to survive, thrive, and escape the city. So why not be prepared for it? Thank you for your comments and your support. Thanks for watching. Get out the field, have some fun. I'm gonna catch you next time.